Film Four came to Colombia. Right now we're in Cali. For me in particular, it's been meaningful because my mother's actually Colombian, and I've also never had the opportunity to connect with Colombian filmmakers actually working in Colombia. Um, so it's actually meant quite a lot to me. We've been down in Colombia for about a week now. We started in Bogota, went out to Manizales, and now we're here in Cali. We've been doing screenings and interviews and uh, workshops and uh, Q and A's. With Film Forward, we reached audiences like young coffee collectors, kids with disabilities, and students that are starting in the audiovisual field. Guatavita is one hour away from Bogota. You show a movie here, people, it's an experience. You know? People are really grateful and it can really produce change. I think the Film Forward program is important because it gives audiences an opportunity to collect with the filmmakers, which I think gives a different depth to watching a film. We are here at uh, the Cultural Center in Ciudad Bolivar, which is a barrio neighborhood kind of on the outskirts of Bogota. And we're doing a screening for the community here. It's uh, packed full of uh, teenagers, young adults in there, and they're almost finished watching the movie. And then we're going to actually show them Sikumi, the short film it's based on, and we're going to talk to them about making short films and then making feature films. It's a great audience for it, you know. The, the film centers a lot around the experiences of young people in Barrow. And I'm always curious to see how how kids of a similar age react to it, you know, what they see in it that is similar to their own experiences. The, the young people in the audience right now could tell us what they think about that. If they see uh, things about life in Barrow that seem familiar to them. We screened back at a cultural center in the outskirts of Manizales and one of the young women that we met there was talking about how the horse had kind of played the same role in her life. It's the only thing that she can depend on and she would just go and spend time and ride and talk to him and he would listen. Uh, one of my favorite moments was um, when we were in Neira, that's a small town uh, in the cafe region. And uh, we got to show films to people that usually don't get to see any films. They have never seen snow in their lives, of course, because we don't have snow here. And they got to see 96 minutes of just snow. That was that was beautiful. It was more than what we expected from Neda. It was special because the kids were so open, so so smart in their questions to the director. He really loved it and he really appreciates it because he has learned that um, everything that you learn new from another culture and from another human being, it's uh, very rich for your life. My name is Jenny Lorena. It's super, it's an intercambio. I think it's awesome how something that's a culture that's so different from Colombia would have the same cultural issues. One of the themes that definitely resonated in Colombia was that you eventually are probably going to go through some difficult times, but there is the possibility of overcoming that. I think in one of the screenings outside of Bogota, after everyone was gone, this guy came up to me and he commented on how hard he thinks that process is to start of dealing with your emotions and getting through anything that you've been through. But it was really sweet because at the end he was like, yeah, I think I'm going to start on that. So. Film is, I think, probably the most communicative art form of our time. And to be able to take something that is from from one culture is, is meant to speak to one culture and take it to, to unexpected places around the world, it's, it's just so valuable. Because I think a, a film is an important part of dialogue between people. You find out things about yourself, you find out things about your film, you find out uh, things about the world that you weren't expecting to find out. So their picture of the world has become a little bit more nuanced and it certainly has been for me, the same thing. My picture of the world has become more nuanced and more interesting because of this experience. Narrative and storytelling is particularly important in Colombia for many reasons. On some level, it's just important because we have lost a lot because of violence. Film is definitely a great vehicle to do that through. My Film Forward experience has been great. I definitely feel inspired to become a part of that force of 
Colombian people that are trying to tell our story. I would like to thank all the Film Forward team and I wish we would have the opportunity to host again Film Forward in Manizales. No, thank you. Muchas gracias a ustedes. Thanks a lot.